We do have showers, we have storms, some forming out to the west right now, so we're going to have to uh, kind of contend with more activity. It's not over with that morning round that rolled through, but this picture is gorgeous this morning. We do have a pretty start out there now. It was a little bit rough in the beginning of the day, a lot of heavy rain, especially up to the north, but now things looking pretty good. A little bit cloudy. Sunset tonight is at 826. Temperature at that point will be at about 75 degrees. What we're looking at currently is 76 degree temp at Midway, 76 for O'Hare. We've got about 74 degrees. Waukegan, 71 for McHenry and Aurora, and 69 degrees in DeKalb. Now, let's take a peek at the radar. I'm going to step out here and zoom you in in just one second. But what we're looking at is basically a little bit of shower and storm activity developing here. you got 80, 88, uh, 355 all being impacted at this point. You can see just a touch of thunderstorm activity as well around Will County, Joliet area, moving towards Orland Park, Frankfurt, and heading on off to the east uh, near Chicago Heights. We're going to see additional shower and storm development a little later on today, but no weather alerts out there right now. There is the potential for us later as we start to see these showers and storms bubbling up for a possible strong damaging winds and maybe some hail. Those would be the main threats and there is the potential for some severe storm activity again a little later on into the day. But what we've got at 930 tonight is still some rain. Looks like most of it will be setting up south of us. Should dry out a bit. Have a decent start on the day on Tuesday followed by some shower and storm chances working back into the picture late Tuesday going into Wednesday. So we're definitely in an active weather pattern around here. We've pushed the slight risk area south now. Storm Prediction Center redrew this recently, so we have a marginal risk from Orland Park and the city stretching up to the north. The slight risk area, again, a little bit closer to where you can see that development when I showed you the future cast. Now it's a little bit farther south, so anybody south of I-80, keep in mind that you've got a better chance of seeing some strong to severe storms a little bit later on. So we had that morning rain, still have some storms out there right now, but just keep your umbrella at the ready because you may need it a little later on this afternoon. 86 degrees uh, the average high temperature today. Tonight we're going to see the shower and storm activity continuing, wrapping up overnight, dropping down to about 69 degrees for the overnight low. And then tomorrow, partly sunny, potential for some shower and storm activity again. But this time it looks like it's going to roll in at night on your Tuesday. Northerly wind at about five miles per hour. And because those storms begin at night on Tuesday, it's also kind of the way we're going to start our day on Wednesday. So again, this kind of busy weather pattern where you need your umbrella handy each day is going to continue you today on your Tuesday and on your Wednesday, but it does look better to end the week and sort of rolling into the weekend. Temperatures pretty summer like in the 80s all the way across the board. I guess we'll need our umbrella all week. Yep. All right. Thank you, Maggie.